The following portion of Daytime Blue Ridge is sponsored by... There's always a great show to check out at the Harvester Performance Center in Rocky Mount. Here to tell us about what's coming up is the CEO, Matt Hankins. Welcome back to the show. Good morning. Glad to be back with you. I know, and you always come with some great uh, new shows that are you know, popping up at your venue. And 2018 looks like a great year. It's going to be a huge year. Yeah. February alone is a huge month. Let's talk about February because Blackberry Smoke just blew up, didn't they? They did. We put tickets on sale yesterday in pre-sale. Tickets go on sale to the general public tomorrow. Uh -huh. uh, and those tickets will probably sell out tomorrow morning. So if you're a Blackberry Smoke fan, I know they performed here in Salem. I saw them myself with the uh, Zach Brown band. Mm -hmm. uh, that they, uh, they're a rock band. They put on a fantastic show, very high energy. They played Lockin' this year and uh, they're, they're coming back. So uh, we're, we're glad to have them at the Harvester. So get your tickets because they will go fast. You were saying that you had people order tickets from what, Alaska? Uh, Alaska, and... Oregon, uh, Michigan, Florida. We, we wow. had them from all over for, for this show. That's so exciting. It, it's drawn a lot of interest. Okay, so there's that. And then we have Tower of Power, the 50th anniversary. Uh, Tower of Power is an amazing funk band. They are legendary. Uh, their big hit was What is Hip, uh, which was uh, played a lot on the Drew, uh, Drew Carey show for people who remember okay. that show. Uh, just a fantastic band, amazing horn section, uh, great rhythms, great bass. Uh, it, it's going to be a fun night. Uh, they, they are legends in the funk uh, 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 music world. Uh, you know, uh, almost uh, synonymous with uh, bands like uh, Parliament Funkadelic and some mm -hmm. of those uh, that uh, are just uh, you know fantastic horn bands. Yeah. Uh, and, and it just get, makes you want to get up and dance and groove around. I was going to say, you're not going to be sitting through that show. You will not be. <laughs> uh, you, if you are, something's wrong. Something's we'll, we'll, wrong we'll come with check you. for a pulse. <laughs> okay, that's February 22nd. And then coming up in January, Taj Mahal. Taj Mahal is a blues legend. He's mm -hmm. uh, uh, played with Keb Mo and Bonnie Raitt and a whole bunch of other blues legends. Uh, we're you know, just tickled to have him here. He's uh, uh, a, a fantastic musician, great writer, uh, and uh, really uh, a connection for uh, everybody to the, the history of the blues, mm -hmm. uh, particularly that, that New Orleans sound. But you know, he, he sort of brings in the, the whole blues uh, genre uh, into one guy. Yeah, uh, I was just watching this video that we're playing, and he sounds awesome. He I does. Love it. I know he's played here in the Roanoke area before, but he's not played at the Harvester, so we're, we're again, cool. very fortunate to have him. And then you have Henry Rollins, the Travel Slideshow. Tell me about him. Um, Henry Rollins is an interesting guy. He's been a punk band uh, lead singer with Black Flag, uh, which was based out of L.A. Uh, he is uh, uh, he, he had his own band, the Henry Rollins Band, uh, but he's also been an actor. He's uh, uh, a teacher, a motivational a, 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 speaker, a, a, a isn't he? Motivational too? speaker, and, and what he's going to bring to our show uh, to the, the Harvester is a travel slideshow. Talk mm -hmm. about some of the interesting travel that he's has been able to do. Uh, we've had a lot of interest in the show. We're uh, around halfway sold out. It's a January show. Uh, so you know, people who are interested in seeing and, and uh, talking to and hearing from Henry Rollins uh, really ought to uh, check out our website at harvester-music.com so that they can get in on that. Yeah, and you brought this poster. And this is just November. So, I mean, just just looking at the, the lineup mm -hmm. of performers, you always have something new and coming up? We do about 180 shows a year. We're uh, you know, very busy at the Harvester. Uh, we're a small venue, so uh, we, we can't do Civic Center type volume you know, where we do one or two shows a month. We have to do a show about every other night. So there's always something going on. We always try to appeal to every sort of genre. Like uh, next week, we've got uh, the Magpie Salute coming up, which is the remaining members of uh, the Black Crows uh -huh. uh, uh, who are coming together to sing some of their hits. They've been selling out shows in Europe. They're, they're mainly doing major metros like New York, Washington, and Atlanta but they're stopping at the Harvester on the way. How cool is that? Harvester-music.com. 